Well, anyways, it cut off. I had to erase some stuff so I'd have more storage. Um, you know, he put his hand on me. I smacked it off and stuff. You know, I told him I was gay. And, you know, I told him about the accident and stuff because, you know, I'm still in my spine brace. But, um, you know, <laughs> I was going to get to one part before I did the other. But, well, anyways, you know, this guy didn't leave. And he told me, who's that guy staring at me? And I didn't even turn around because I didn't see Shorty nowhere around but I have felt his eyes on me I said is he dark he said yeah I said does he have a baby in his hands he said yeah he, he said he won't, he won't take his eyes off me he's like really looking at me I said oh that's my brother you know, at the end of the night, when everybody was cleaning up, and Shorty, Miguel, Michael, you know, he was cleaning up. He asked me, he goes, I have, well, he goes, I have my eyes on you. I was watching out for you, or some shit like that. He said he had his eyes on me. He goes, why were all those guys coming to the tent? To our tent? I said, I have no clue. I said, they just came up and sat down next to me and started talking to me. Yeah, he was keeping an eye on me. In a brotherly way. You know, I could handle myself, but I was vulnerable because I was in a spine brace. So he was watching out for me, you know. And that's the last day, you know, I had took that spine brace off. And that's the last time I had the spine brace on 24-7 since the accident. I mean, mind you, I used it, you know, yeah, but I didn't use it 24-7. So I felt stronger around him. So home isn't just a city or where you're from. Home are the people that love you and care about you. Home are your brothers. Home is your family. Where you are, you know, like I said, we live in different places now, a lot of us. Some of us still live there. But our heart is with home. Hawthorne, but it's more than just a city. Home is the people that we we love that are from Hawthorne. Home is our kids. Home is where where there's people that love you. You get me? Well, back to, back to Wino, one of my mains. And I love his heart so much. <laughs> and I'm thinking, these guys, what if I would have been straight? Because, you know, come to find out when I'm older, when I got older, a lot of them knew I was gay. And before, way before I even figured it out. But I come to think, like, what if I was straight? You know what I mean? 
you know, I'm celibate. You know, I've been celibate. And the end of December, it'll be three years. It'll be three years.